Hi, I'm Michelle Obama. And I'm Jill Biden. April is the month of the military child, a time for our nation to recognize the strength, the sacrifice, and the special contribution that children of our servicemen and women make to America. Every day, these extraordinary young people shoulder responsibilities and worries that make them wise beyond their years. They watch their parents go to work wearing our nation's uniform. During this time of war, they may have one or even both parents deployed overseas and standing in harm's way. They may even have to care for a parent who is wounded or in the most painful situations, be called to keep alive the memory of a fallen hero whom they called mom or dad. As a grateful nation, it is our sacred responsibility to stand by our military children just as they and their families stand by us. From improving the schools where they learn, to strengthening the communities where they live, to supporting the parents and guardians who are raising them. President Obama is committed to ensuring that this administration does everything it can to support our military children. But government can only do so much. That is why we are encouraging our fellow Americans to make time and find ways to recognize and support the military children in their community. As the mother of a National Guardsman, I have seen firsthand the difference that a small act of kindness can make. It can be as simple as reaching out to the new military family in your neighborhood or connecting with one of the many organizations dedicated to supporting our service members and their families. There's a role for each and every one of us in supporting military children. Let's mark the month of the military child this year by dedicating ourselves to honoring and supporting these brave children all year long. 